just about ready to cross from Wisconsin to Michigan, we think. Almost to Ironwood. We're JK and Kim, and we love traveling, exploring, and enjoying the hashtag van life way of RV. With our fur babies in our 2019 Thor Motor Coach Vegas 24 1, who we've named Elvis, we could be called weekend camping warriors because we're still juggling several busy careers, but we're hitting the road whenever we can. Follow along with us as we enjoy what we call hashtag van life for big people. How is Wisconsin? Not bad. I'd like to go back to a couple of those places. They look pretty cool that we just zoomed by. Some lakeshore way spots and uh, a harbor that looked cool and go back to Mayfield and see if we can look around there during the week when it's not so crowded. Yeah, we're not one for crowds. Pine trees are plentiful. The color is not so plentiful yet. We're hoping that Michigan is turning a little, um, a little more colorful than Wisconsin was. There's been pockets, but not much like we had hoped. We're crossing the border. There's a pure Michigan sign. You see it? Boy, that's pretty small. Inside the state of Michigan, we headed by the Powderhorn Mountain in through Wakefield and then cut down to Bruce Crossing before heading up towards Copper Harbor at the very tip of Michigan's UP. 
pretty ambitious driving. We didn't know what was ahead of us. It was gonna be a long day. We're kind of getting into some, lack of a better word, mountains. They just had an advertisement billboard for a ski mountain, so I'm guessing it's that guy right there. Big powder. hit so many bugs today. Trying the rain -X. I guess they're just black flies, but nasty, nasty splats. There he goes. Clean, clean, clean. You could just do this nonstop. I wonder if they're biting flies. Not looking forward to that. I hope not. Horse flies. On the road to Copper Harbor, and all of a sudden we hit trees that were like a canopy overhanging the road and nestly feeling. This is Highway 41 to Copper Harbor. There's a Highway 26 that's supposed to be scenic that I think follows the, the water line and the coast of Lake Michigan, but this is pretty darn pretty. been a long day probably too long of a leg from where we started we did a lot today and uh, the roads were a lot more hilly turny curvy than I ever expected them to be so definitely allow for a lot of extra time through here it's beautiful though and sprinkles off and on
Cecil to the left, Port Lincolns is where we're going, State Park. There's a gift center right here, still open. 